discuss something about inflammatory bowel disease. Inflammatory bowel disease is of two types. One is Crohn's disease, the other one is ulcerative colitis. Crohn's disease can involve any part of the intestine starting from mouth to the anus. Whereas ulcerative colitis, it usually involves the rectum and from there it can ascend to any extent above. Sometimes the whole colon can uh, have ulcerative colitis. Sometimes the ulcerative colitis can be limited to the left colon or to the rectum alone. These two conditions are very troubling, troublesome conditions which are initially treated by medical management. So when do these conditions require surgery? In Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis, it is the complications of these diseases which warrant surgical treatment. If you see ulcerative colitis, patients who are not responding to medications or patients who develop complications of ulcerative colitis like toxic megacolon or perforation of the colon or severe bleed from these ulcerative colitis, they require surgery. The surgery for ulcerative colitis includes the removal of the colon and rectum in its entirety which we call it as restorative proctocolectomy and we restore the continuity of the intestine by making a pouch from the small intestine which we call as the pouch surgery.